Hello guys, today I'm going to show you the very important parts of Matrix, which is the introduction part of Matrix. So, let's begin. So, uh, it's a Matrix. The Matrix, it is a rectangular array of numbers of the form A is equal to a11 log a11 a21 am1 a12 a22 am2 a1 an a2 n am n this is the form of matrix or matrix can be written in this form okay and it's abbreviated as is equal to a i j m cross n the horizontal arrangement of the array is called the row. This part, the, the horizontal form is known as the row. While the vertical arrangement of the, the matrix is called the column. This part is the column. This part is the column. Uh, and M cross N is the size or the order of the matrix. Okay. Uh, let us do an example. Uh, look, uh, there is a matrix A is giving us A is equal to 2, 1, 3, 1, 6, 0, 3, 7, 5. So, uh, A11 is 2, A12 is 1, A13 is 3 here, and A22, A22 is 6, A31, A32 is 0 and the like so all things are given there and the matrix 3 by 3 yeah the, you know the matrix is 3 by 3 because it has three rows and three columns since the matrix has three rows and three columns the order is 3 by 3 and the other main topic under uh, this presentation is equality of matrix Two matrix A and B are said to be equal if and only if they have the same size, uh, all the corresponding integers are equal. If they have the same size and all the corresponding integers are equal, so we call it uh, it's an equal matrix. Look, for example, uh, let matrix A is equal to 10, 2, 7, 4, and matrix B is given us. 10, 2, 7, 4, and so C, matrix C is given us 2, 1, 4, 5. From this, A is equal to B, but B is not equal to B is not equal with C. Look. Because the Matrix A and matrix B have the same size and corresponding entry. Okay, uh, let's do an example. Another example. Uh, find the value of x, y, z. Say that uh, the matrix is given as x square plus 2, and here is 3, y minus 3, uh, 4. Uh, which is equal to 6 to z minus 3 1 4 so look this value equals with this value and this 3 is equal to 2 to z minus 3 uh, this is the solution part uh, x squared plus 2 is equal to 6 x squared plus 2 is equal to 6 and the value x will become plus or minus 2 and y minus 3 is equal to 1, the value of y will be 4. And finally, 2z minus 3 is equal to 3, that means z will become 3. This other main topic is types of matrix. Matrix can be divided into two different types. The first one is zero or null matrix. Uh, in this matrix, all the entries are zero. An example uh, matrix A which is given as 0 0 0 so guys as you see from the presentation A is equal to 0 0 0 0 this is a null matrix and the next type of matrix is a row matrix 
uh, which is a matrix having exactly one row. For example, a is equal to 2, 3, 7, I mean 2, 3, 6, 2, uh, which is only have one row and which is called a row matrix. The other is the column matrix. The column matrix is a matrix having exactly one column. Look, this matrix has only one And the next type of matrix which is a square matrix, a matrix in which the number of row and column are equal. So such kind of matrix is called square matrix. And uh, for example, uh, let matrix here which is equal to 5582718086. Five, which have equal which have equal rows and columns. So, uh, due to the number of columns and the number of row I call then, which is called a square matrix, and the other is diagonal matrix. A square matrix in which all non diagonal interests are zero. Have you seen? All the non diagonal interests are zero. Look, 2, 0, 0, 0, 2, 5, 0, uh, 0, 0, 3. Look, the diagonal. The diagonal is non zero, whereas in the non diagonal uh, is non zero, I mean, uh, is zero. This is non zero, whereas the non diagonal part is uh, zero. So, uh, such kind of matrix is called diagonal matrix. And the other is scalar matrix. A scalar matrix, uh, which is a diagonal matrix in which uh, all the diagonal entries are the same. Uh, let A uh, is equal to 300030003. Look, scalar means having the same value. The diagonal part of uh, the diagonal matrix have equal entries. Look, 3, 3, 3, they are equal. So, such kind of matrix is called scalar matrix. And the other type of matrix is identity matrix. Uh, a diagonal matrix in which all the diagonals are zero. Uh, look, if we change this part into one, we call it its uh, identity matrix. And the next type of matrix is triangular matrix. It's a type of square matrix in which all the entry have or below the diagonal is zero. If the value below the diagonal is zero, we call it upper triangular matrix. And if the entry have a diagonal um, it zero it is also called uh, lower triangular matrix look for example uh, this is a triangular matrix because above and below the diagonal have a different value look this is a triangular have you seen this is a triangular B above the, the diagonal, which is uh, all values are zero, so it is called lower triangular matrix. Uh, whereas this value looks 3, 4, 10, 3, 8, 1. Above the triangular has a value, but below the triangular, all values are zero, so which is called upper triangular matrix. And the next operation of matrix, uh, let A uh, is equal to A. Ij, uh, which is m by n, and b is equal to uh, b i j m cross n, uh, b any two matrix. So, how to operate, how to add, how to subtract, how to divide and multiply uh, the matrix? So, the first topic under here is uh, addition of matrix. Then look the values given here. Then the sum of a plus b is obtained by adding the corresponding entry as a plus b, which is a i j uh, plus b i j with m cross n. And the subtraction of a matrix. How to subtract a matrix? So the difference between a and b. It can be written as a minus b is obtained by subtracting the corresponding entry as a minus b, which is a i j minus b i j with m cross n, where m cross n is the size of the matrix. 
In order to add and subtract the matrix, it should have the same size. That means A and B have the same size. For example, it may be 2 by 2 or 3 by 3 matrix, unless it's now possible to add or to subtract the matrix. And the other is scalar multiplication of a matrix. The scalar multiplication KA of A is obtained by multiplying each entry of A by the scalar K as K is equal to K I J M cross N, uh, which is the size or the order of the matrix, and K is a scalar multiplication. Example it A is equal to 2, 3, 3, minus 4, and B is equal to 1, 2, 2, 4. So, here A plus B is equal to, we have to add the value of A with the value of B. 2 plus 1, 3 plus 2, 3 plus 2, minus 4 plus 4, the value will be here. And uh, when we subtract that value, 2 minus 1, 3 minus 2, 3 minus 2, minus 4, minus 4. The value is 1, 1, 1, minus 8, which is a subtraction of matrix. Here is the addition of matrix. And through A, it is a scalar multiplication of matrix. Uh, simply multiply by the scalar. Each value should be multiplied by the scalar value, which is 3. So 3 times 2, 3 times 3, 3 times 3, 3 times minus 4. So the value will be here 2, 9, 9, minus 12, which is a scalar multiplication. Let's do another example. Uh, let A is equal to 2 minus 1, 1, B minus 3. And the value of matrix B is, sorry, 1, 1 minus 2. And matrix C have a value 3, 1, C minus 2. Then find the value of A, B, C such that 2A is equal to 3B plus C. So, how to find the value of A, B, and C? Uh, so, uh, first I have to multiply the value of A with 2, 2 times A minus 1, uh, B minus 1, and minus 3, and 3 times B, 3 times this value, plus the value of C, plus the value of C, then the outcome will be my 2A minus 2, uh, 2B, two, 2 minus 8, which is equal to 9, 3, 3 minus 6 plus 3 1 C minus 2 So finally the value will be 2 a minus 2 is equal to 12 Look we have to equalize 2 a minus 2 is equal to 12. So the value of a is 7 To be this value is equal to 4 then B becomes 2 and finally 3 look 3 plus C 3 plus c, 3 plus c is equal to 2, then the value of t will be minus 1. The other is uh, matrix multiplication. Mm, so, how to multiply a matrix? Uh, there are two types of multiplication, scalar multiplication and matrix multiplication. So, uh, this is a matrix multiplication. Let R1, R2, R, M uh, be the row of a matrix. Uh, matrix A and C1, C2, C R B is a column of a matrix B. Then the product of A B is defined as defined as product is equal to A B. That is R1 C1, R2 C1, R M C1. So the value of R when we uh, increase the column, uh, the uh, R value also increase, but the C value is constant. And here also R2, R2, Rm. I mean R1, R2, Rm. The R value is increase and the C value is comma, or it's uh, uh, the same. Here also the T value is common and the R value is increased. So in such a way we can multiply a matrix. Uh, example one. Let A be 1, 2, 0, minus 3, and B become, will be minus, um, uh, if B is equal to minus 2, 1, 3, minus 1, then the product AB, uh, how to calculate the product AB? So, we have to substitute this value into this form. 
So look, uh, 1 times minus 2 plus 2 times 1. 1 times minus 2, 2 times 1. And 0 times minus 2, minus 3 times 1. And here, and here, 1 times, 1 times 3, plus 2 times minus 1. 0 times 3, 0 times 3, plus minus 3 times minus 1. Then the value becomes uh, 0, 1, minus 3, minus 3. This is a matrix multiplication uh, for. Example 2. Find the value of the constant A, B, C, and D if uh, A is given as uh, uh, in this way. In this is such a way. 2, 1, A, B times 8, minus 3, 0, 2, which is equal to this value. And the other example B is given as A, 2, 3, 6, uh, 4 minus 3, 7, C, I mean B, uh, which is equal to 15, 5, C, 39, 2D. So, how to calculate, how to calculate or how to find the value of your PCD? So, uh, you have to try to calculate uh, using a paper and pen. So, uh, the solution part is here. Look, 16 plus 0, uh, 8a plus 0, uh, uh, minus 6 plus minus 2, minus 3a plus minus 2b, which is equal to this value is 16 simply, and this value is 8a, and this value is minus 8, and this value become minus of 3a plus 2b, then, which is equal to 4c, d, minus 16, and 12. 8a which is equal to minus 16 the value of a is uh, minus 2 and uh, look minus of 3a plus 2b is equal to 12 uh, which implies that the the value of b is equal to minus or something and finally uh, 4 is equal to 6 uh, 16 i mean the value of uh, c uh, c is 4 and uh, this equals to minus 4 and uh, I guess uh, the end uh, example B a 3 2 6 4 minus 3 7 B which is equal to 15 5 C 39 and 2 D so uh, by using a matrix multiplication or rule the value will become 4 a minus 9 minus 10 7 a plus 3 b 14 plus 6 b which is equal to 15 5 c 39 2 b so uh, here uh, 4 a minus 9 is equal to 15 4 a minus 9 which equal to 15 the value of a will be 4 i mean 6 and uh, 70 plus 3b, 70 plus 3b, which is equal to 3, 9, and the value of p becomes minus 1. And finally, 5c, uh, uh, which is equal to minus 10, the value of c is equal to 2. So, and to find the value of the uh, 14 plus 6b, which is equal to 2d. 14 plus 6b is equal to 2d, and the value of d is 4. Okay, thank you for watching. This is uh, our presentation and please like and subscribe uh, for more videos. Goodbye.